Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Today will be super helpful video to any of you having a Ford F-150, that generation right there between year 2009 and year 2014. If you guys have one of those, you need to find where the fuse guys for the front or rear power windows is located. Stay with us, we're going to explain that in this video today now. Uh, now, uh, <coughs> we have multiple fuses that we need to check. Make sure you stand till the end. Second, we're going to explain where to buy cheap fuses and relays from. And third guys, we're going to explain Explain why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays so you don't waste your money and time. Before we start, let me tell you a little bit about us guys. On this channel you will find all the fuse videos on Ford F-150. We're going to make video for every single fuse, so if you're on the road, stuck in the middle of somewhere, you need to find a specific fuse, you can just come to the channel, search for it, find it in less than, let's say, 30 seconds. You don't even need to pull your manual out of the glove box, and most of the times you will be even missing this one. Something else guys. Uh, we take cars here at the garage and we take them completely apart. We fix engines, transmissions, bodywork. We show you how to fix pretty much anything. And the mechanical work, guys, okay, electric codes and things like that can be found on our main YouTube channels. Uh, those are all uh, our other channels and this one is our new channel where we're going to share just fuses so we can make it really convenient for you to find the information that you need. Now if you need to buy replacement fuses, relays for your Ford F-150 because do, those can be really expensive at the parts store or, or the dealership, check out the link in the description of the video below, that's where we get all our two supplies from and you can get them at a really good price and quick shipping as well. So let's continue. So specifically guys, okay, we're going to demonstrate right here on Ford F-150 2012 year model. We have two fuse boxes guys. One is located under the hood right here. You can see in the engine bay above the radiator and when you open that fuse box it looks like that. Uh, now we have another one that's inside the vehicle under the dash under the glove box right here guys on the passenger side by that kick panel you remove the cover there and you're going to have a uh, fuse box that looks just like that so if you need to find the fuse for the front and rear power windows guys okay uh, stay with us and we're going to explain now which specific fuses we need to check but before we start let's explain why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays so you don't waste your money and time so let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses. Fuses not often you can see if they're burned or they're good. Sometimes they may seem perfectly fine, you think it's a good fuse, you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that uh, do not exist guys when all you have to do test your fuse, find out it's bad, replace it, fix your problem. So we will have a video how to test a fuse, okay different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys. We're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out so which fuses you need to check right here now specifically guys we're going to come and count the third row from left to right and if you come right here that third fuse right before the relay that 15m fuse is known as fuse number 32 check that fuse that's one of them then you have one specific fuse that's for the master window switch and we're talking about that one right here that's fuse number 48 now, uh, you guys have uh, two more fuses that you need to check. They will be in the fuse box that's located under the hood. And if you look at it, it will be that way. Uh, for the front left window, you will have fuse number F1 right here. And then you have fuse number F3 right there, guys. So all those four fuses need to be checked for the power windows. Hopefully the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching. See you next time. 